I probably won't make another Linux video, it's just not what Rocket League players are interested in. Now would you look at this clown bro. Okay so a while ago I made a tutorial on how you can install the Steam version of Rocket League on Linux. It actually got more views than I expected and so in this video I will show you the same thing but for the Epic Games version of Rocket League. Like in the last video, I'm assuming the following. You're using Ubuntu, PopOS or a similar Debian based distro. If you don't, then I assume that you're at least able to install Lutris on your own. With that said, let's get started. Open up whatever application store came with your distro. If you have any updates to do, do them first. Moving on, we will search for Lutris and install it. When it's done, you can go to your Applications menu and launch Lutris. If Lutris doesn't start, we can try the following fix. If it works for you though, you can skip to the timestamp on screen. Open the link provided in the description of this video. You will find this weird long file that we need to download. When it's done, we will open a new file explorer window and enable show hidden files. Next we navigate to .local, share, lotris, runtime and finally dxvk. Now we just move the downloaded file into this folder. I have done this already so I will cancel here. With lotris open we will click on lotris on the sidebar and then search for the epic games store. We will click on install, hit install again. And here you can change the path of the installation if you would like to do so. I don't need to do any changes, so I will just continue with the installation. This will take its sweet time, so I will just speed up the process for you. Once it's done, you can choose to create some shortcuts. If you don't create them, you can still create them afterwards in Lutris. Okay, so now we've reached the easy part. From our applications menu or from Lutris, we can open the Epic Games Store. This weird thing right here is just what you would see on Windows on the bottom right. Clicking on it just reveals how much longer we need to wait for Epic Games to finish their update. You don't need to keep that open, so you can just close it and forget about it. Now if you don't already own Rocket League, you can go to the store, search for it and just get it for free. Once it is in your library, just click on it and hit install. Now at this point we're nearly done, we can launch it and we will get the Rocket League intro. For some reason the game lagged for me in the beginning, so if you have the same problem you can just go to Lutris and then kill all wine processes and this will basically murder Rocket League and the Epic Game Store and everything and it will just close. And after starting the game again. It just runs fine. If you're interested in the frames per second, I have enabled it on the top right. I'm almost constantly at 250 frames. Sure, there are some more dips than on Windows, but it's actually not noticeable at all. Okay, so you've reached the end. This was how to install the Epic Games version of Rocket League on Linux. If you like this video, you know what to do. I appreciate every support that I get. And so this really was the last, last, last video on Linux that I do on this channel. 
I'm very interested in making other content, so if you have some ideas, just uh, leave them in the comments below. So yeah, thanks for watching.